Hey guys, figured I would just go along and um, explain exactly what's been going on in this tutorial here. Um, the tutorial here is explaining how to combine the tab bar um, controller along with the navigation controller and a table view as well as pushing on a detail view. Um, if you look on the screen here, we've got the tab bar controller with the simple UI view controller and then on the first one. And then the second one is a navigation controller which also contains a table view and the detail view. If you go to the detail view and check out the identity inspector you'll see they added a new field called identifier. It's kind of like giving a nib name for a nib file. Um, here we named it detail and if you go to our second view controller and you look we set up the array with all of the dummy variables here. Um, the number of rows in section is the um, count of the array. The text is filled with um, our object index variables and then if you see did select row at index we're doing something different here this is what they added in with the storyboards um, you basically call the class or of the of the view and then you call the storyboard itself and you say instantiate view controller with identifier and that's basically like saying init with nib name it's basically looking for whichever con view controllers you have within the storyboard with this title um, and then following that you just push it onto the navigation controller and uh, we have a little thing here that just tells you what row is selected and this is for the off one since um, index path dot row starts at zero instead of one and we're gonna get here and run it and we'll see that the first one is indeed the UI view controller and the second one is our table view of 13 objects. If we go to, let's go to like 10, and you see that it does push the detail view and you have the navigation controller along with the top as well. You can go back and select another one and it does update the detail view with whichever one is selected. So, um, this is pretty much the summary of the tutorial here. Um, if there's anything else, please post a question in the comment. There's a donation button to the right. Um, anything is is more than appreciated, and uh, hopefully I'll get to talk to you guys again soon.